and welcome back to the breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install Mouse Tweaks in Minecraft 1.14.4. Mouse Tweaks is a, a pretty simple mod to be honest and it allows you to use your mouse to do things a bit differently in Minecraft that you can't do in vanilla Minecraft. For example, there's the RBM tweak and this is standard to the basically dragging method that's in default Minecraft. However, if you drag over a slot multiple times, an atom will be put there multiple times, replacing the standard method. So normally, let's say you're making, you know, these, uh, like a, a furnace here. In normal Minecraft, if you were to do the dragging method, it would just put three uh, of these all around, right? It would be this down here. However, with this new method, you have to uh, drag it multiple times around to get it to work. That's something I actually like more than the default standard. You've also got the LBM tweak, and basically what this does is allow you to quickly pick up items of the same type if you move them. So pick up an item, hold your left mouse button to pick it up, and then just drag, right? So hold your left, left mouse button and then drag across, and it'll pick up all the same item and immediately put it into your inventory. So at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you some of this in game, but it's pretty cool. You've also got the LBM tweak without an item. You can do it with an empty cursor by holding shift, and then dragging your left mouse button over. Same similar concept, and it'll pick up everything, not just, you know, the item that's in your hand. So overall, really, really cool. There's also some wheel tweaks and different configuration settings there. But overall, let's go ahead and get this mod installed. First, though, we have a message from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get an incredible 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. We actually love Apex so much that we host our own server, play.breakdowncraft.com on them. So again, if you want an incredible Minecraft server for you and your friends to play, on, Apex Minecraft hosting is the way to go. You can check out Apex at the first link down below. The breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and get Mouse Tweaks installed. The first thing you want to do is, well, download Mouse Tweaks. And to do that, you're going to go to the second link down below and it's going to take you here. And then once you're here, you're going to scroll down. And on the right hand side over here, you'll see Minecraft 1.14. You see that? Under recent files, you'll see Minecraft 1.14. And then you'll see like this Mouse Tweaks download. It should say 1.14 Mouse Tweaks. If it does, click that purple download button next to that version. And the download will begin in five seconds. Basically, it takes us off to this download page where your download will begin in five seconds. And boom, there's the download. It's going to download in the bottom left. And as long as it says Mouse Tweaks in the title, which ours does, we're good to keep the file on Google Chrome in the bottom left. Under center of your screen is where it's popped up on Firefox, and you're going to save it on Firefox in the center of your screen. Now, we're not done downloading just yet. We still need to download Forge. And you can find Forge at the third link down below. When you go down there, you'll find Forge here. This is actually our tutorial on how to download and install Forge for my if I go too fast in this video or in anything, this tutorial will help you out. However, I'm going to be going over the entire process in this video. So once you're here, all you want to do is click the green Download Forge button. That will then take us off to Forge's official download page here, where we want to make sure we are downloading for Minecraft 1.14.4. As we can see here, MC 1.14.4 is here, so we're on the correct version. If you aren't on the correct version, no worries. If it doesn't say MC 1.14.4 there, all you need to do is come over here to the left-hand side, click on the plus button on 1.14, and then click on 1.14.4 there. It'll then say MC 1.14.4 here, and you're good to go. Now what we want to do is come under Download Recommended over here and click on the Installer button right there. So Download Recommended and click on installer. It's then going to download Forge in the bottom left on Google Chrome. When it does that, you want to make sure you click keep. It should just say Forge 1.14.4, which ours does, so we're good to keep the file. On Mozilla Firefox, it has popped up in the center of your screen, and again, you're good to save the file as long as it does say Forge and 1.14.4 in the title. Nevertheless, we are now done downloading. So we minimize our browser. These are on my desktop. We have mouse tweaks on my desktop and Forge. These may not be on your desktop though. And if they aren't, where are they? Well, no worries, we can find them. All you need to do is come to the Windows icons in the top left for me, but in the bottom left of your screen most likely. However, it could also be in the top of your screen. Basically, that little Windows icon in the bottom left or top left of your screen. Go ahead and click on that and then go ahead and type in downloads, right like so. You'll then have this downloads file folder in Windows. Click on that and in here you will find mouse tweaks and forge. Drag them to your desktop just for ease of use. Once these are on your desktop, we can go ahead and start off by installing Forge. To do this, right click on Forge, click on Open With, and then you should have Java TM Platform SE Binary. But Nick, what if I don't have Java TM Platform SE Binary? Well, no worries whatsoever, we've got you covered. You want to go to the description of this video, and you'll have a link to how to download and install Java. The breakdown at XYZ slash Java is the link. Once you're here, it will go through every single step you need to do to get Java for Minecraft. On top of that, it is also going to go through everything you need to know in order to get the Java SE development kit in order to run Forge. It's all the same process and it comes down through here and goes over it all. Now, if you do that and you still can't open Forge, you're still having issues. 
no worries. We have you covered yet again. We have the jar fix. The jar fix is basically a simple and little tool that you can run on your computer to connect all the jar files on your computer back to Java once again. It does it all for you. It's a quick and easy program. This tutorial goes through how to run it. Then finally, you'll be able to come back to Forge, right click on it, click on open with, and then click on Java TM platform SE binary and click OK. It will now open up the Forge mod installer here and specifically the mod installer for Forge. You don't install mods this way, you're just installing Forge this way. Nevertheless, once you're here, you just want to make sure install client is selected and then go ahead and click OK. It will now go through, download, install everything it needs to do to get Forge actually in Minecraft on your computer. Now, one of the things I will say, you can still play vanilla Minecraft while playing Forge. It's not a problem. And as you can see, we have successfully installed client profile Forge for version 1.0. 14.4. However, what if you don't get that? What if it airs out? Well, if it airs out, it would 100% of the time is because you need to go play Minecraft 1.14.4 for this to work, right? You need to go play vanilla Minecraft 1.14.4 with no mods, no anything installed, come back, and then it'll successfully install. Now we can go ahead and click OK here. It'll close out of that, and it's time to install Mouse Tweaks. Installing Mouse Tweaks is actually a pretty simple process. You want to go back up to the top left for me, bottom left of your screen, that little Windows icon at the top or bottom left of your screen. Click on that and then type in Run, R-U-N. You'll then have this Run application here. As you can see, Run App. You're going to want to go ahead and click on that. And then it'll open up this little application. Then in this search box here, we're going to type percent sign APP DATA percent sign percent app data percent exactly like that and hit enter. It'll then open up our roaming folder here where you'll have a dot Minecraft folder. Then when you open up that dot Minecraft folder, you should have yourself a mods folder. But Nick, what if I don't have a mods folder? What do I do? Don't freak out. It's okay. We just need to create one. Just right click in this white space over here, create a new folder, and then title that folder mods, M-O-D-S, exactly like that, all lowercase. Do not change anything about that. It must be mods and it must be all lowercase or it won't work. Once you've got that, go ahead and open up your newly created mods folder. And now all we need to do to install Mouse Tweaks in Minecraft 1.14.4 is drag the Mouse Tweaks download we got from the download link into our mods folder. Boom. Mouse Tweaks drag and dropped over 1.14.4. That is looking good. Now all we need to do is open up the Minecraft launcher and make sure we are playing the correct version of Minecraft. If we're not, then, well, obviously this won't work. So once we open up Minecraft here, don't hit that play button. What are you doing? Watch yourself. What you want to do is click this little arrow right over here to the left, and you should have a Forge profile. Now, we do, but what if you don't? What if you don't have the Forge profile, and you can't click on it and click play because you don't have it? Well, no worries. We have a solution. Obviously, we're covering everything here. What we want to do is go to the Installations tab up here at the top of Minecraft. Once you're here, you're going to want to create a new installation, right? It's a pretty simple process. Right here, just create the plus new button. Click on that. And then you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to name it play.breakdowncraft.com. Why am I naming it that? Because that is our grief protected survival and skyblock server. It's absolutely incredible. You'll love it. We've got two survival servers, medieval survival with over 25 custom quests, new quests getting added every single month, an incredible community, a player based economy. It's awesome. Then we have aquatic survival, which is a slash shop based economy with custom crates, all sorts of awesome stuff. And then on top of that, we do have a custom custom skyblock server with an incredible community op enchants you will absolutely love it come play with us play.breakdowncraft.com is the ip i didn't want to mention factions is coming soon so yeah join our discord for that if you want to be notified on factions and stuff but nevertheless play.breakdowncraft.com come play with us on it but nevertheless let's go ahead and look at latest or the version here just click on this a uh, version drop down box here and then when you do you're going to want to find forge now you might have to scroll a little bit but right here it is release 1.14.4 dash forge go ahead and click on that i'm going to change my resolution just so you all will be able to see in game then we can go ahead and click create now we have this new profile down here it's called play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse, and it should say 1.14.4-forge under it. If it does, highlight it, scroll over, and click the green play button on that installation. Now, Minecraft 1.14.4 will open up, and you'll be good to go. It will have set up mouse weeks. It'll be working, and we'll show you that it's working in-game. Now, one thing I do want to mention is it's going to take a while to launch Forge, especially on your first in like launch of it, but it might take a while after that, too. Now, in startup, Forge... 41.14.4 has been known to freeze. It's not going to do it this time, but sometimes it'll just freeze in here in this loading bar and it'll act like it's not working. If it does that, just click the red X and then relaunch it. Just play it again. It's going to say it crashed on stuff. It's fine. Just click the play button again and it will work. 
I don't know why it does that, but it's something I've noticed on multiple mods in 1.14, and I always like to mention it. Now, if we click on mods here, we will see Mouse Tweaks is, in fact, installed, and you can see the home page here. If you do want, like, any information or anything like that on Mouse Tweaks, just click on this and open that link because it will show you basically all of that and, like, how to use Mouse Tweaks and everything. So, if we go into single player here, I'm going to go ahead, and I think this is going to be a safe world to jump into. Um, you never know when to, with me what worlds I've done mod tutorials on and are broken and what aren't and all that stuff. So it's kind of it's kind of a fun journey sometimes. But we're going to launch right on in here. And um, I hope cheats are enabled. But let's go ahead and get ourselves just some cobblestone, I guess. We'll get some uh, some wood as well. And now we're going to uh, we're going to use some inventory each week. So let's see. Oh, and well, actually, we'll get quite a bit of of wood here because we'll want to make a, we'll want to do a chest thing when we yeah we'll do a, a chest thing as well. This is fun. I actually really enjoy like kind of setting this up and like this mod. This is a really simple, really easy mod that is pretty cool. So we go ahead and open this up here. One of the things we can now do is that, right? See how easy that was? It just moved this around right like that. Now that's actually something that's in default Minecraft, but the difference is if we keep moving it around, it adds it instead of, you know, adding it all at once, right? So very, very simple there. But yeah, there you have it. That is how you can download and install Mouse Tweaks in Minecraft 1.14.4. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. Come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. You will absolutely love it. If you want more intricacies on how to use Mouse Tweaks, you can come back over here here to the download link in the description and it kind of goes over everything and how to use it and all that stuff as well as you know how to tweak it and you know do all that stuff it's all covered here in this download page but yeah now you know how to get it come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com the best minecraft server in the multiverse my name is nick this has been the breakdown thank you all so so much for watching and i am out peace